Imagine casually looking out into your garden and seeing a hummingbird hovering above a flower. Upon closer inspection, you aren't sure if it's a hummingbird at all. It isn't a bird, it's a bug. A hummingbird hawk moth to be exact. It's easy to mistake these insects for hummingbirds. They have large compound eyes that resemble bird eyes, are larger than most other insects at 2 to 2.5 inches, and have gray hairs all over their bodies that look like feathers. With orange-gray-brown wings beating up to 80 beats per second and a long proboscis, the flexible tube-like mouth part in insects used for sucking that looks like a long, thin beak, it's easy to mistake the hummingbird hawk moth for a real hummingbird. The phenomenon, known as convergent evolution, is when two separate species, with no relation to one another, develop extremely close physical structures and functions. Such are the hummingbird hawk moth and the hummingbird. However, insect wings are more rigid and therefore less efficient than bird wings. So the hummingbird hawk moth has to beat its wings almost 50% faster than a hummingbird to achieve the same hovering result. The hummingbird hawk moth is one of the various moths in the Sphinx family, also known as Sphingidae due to how closely they resemble the Egyptian Sphinx. Most of the moths in the Sphinx family are nocturnal, but the hummingbird hawk moth prefers to operate and feed during the day. Similar to Blade, this moth could be referred to as the Daywalker. Unlike the majority of species of moths, the hummingbird hawk moth prefers to feed during the day rather than at night. With these unusual differences in habits, it has developed some different features in its eyes to help it recognize details about the surroundings during the day. The middle of its eye, for example, has developed more photoreceptors than the outside of the eye, most likely to be able to track flowers moving in the wind as it hovers above them to feed. They feed on nectar from flowers and tend to congregate around areas with bountiful, nectar-rich flowers, such as red valerian and honeysuckle. The hummingbird hawk moth tends to prefer flowers with longer, thinner sepals, the base of the flower, because it protects the nectar from most other insects and animals. Their specialized proboscis can easily reach into these flowers and capitalize on that sweet, sweet nectar. The hummingbird hawk moth is mostly found in southern Europe, but has been found in Asia and northern Africa to weather the winter. When the weather warms up, populations push farther into Europe and even as far as Russia. Hummingbirds aren't native to Europe, so many alleged sightings are actually false sightings and can be attributed to the hummingbird hawk moth populations in the areas of sightings. If you know where to report identity theft, please let your local hummingbird hawk moth know so they can report it. On average, the hummingbird hawk moth breeds twice a year, similar to most marriages today. It lays around 200 eggs on the underside of several host plants' leaves. The eggs tend to hatch within one to two weeks, depending on the temperature. When it hatches, the larva, also known as the hornworm, feeds on the host plant until it reaches maturity, which takes around 20 days. In this stage of the hummingbird hawk moth, the young are called hornworms. They tend to feed mostly on leaves and don't draw too much attention due to the minimal damage inflicted on garden plants. Other types of hummingbird moth caterpillars can seriously damage crops, such as tomato hornworms, which feed on the actual tomato rather than the leaves. Once it is fully grown, the larva digs into the soil near the host plant to pupate a few inches deep. After about two weeks, the hummingbird moth hawk emerges from its cocoon, ready to take on the town and suck the nectar from every flower in its immediate area. Since the hummingbird hawk moths are large enough to be seen easily, but small enough to be considered a snack, they are eaten by a wide range of animals. Owls, birds of prey, rodents, and bats all hunt the hummingbird hawk moth. Don't worry, hummingbird hawk moths are quick and have a fair shot at getting away to feed another day.